You know, I've heard you speak on Friday, and I wanted to know really where we are. But Matthew 24, 9 says that we will suffer affliction and tribulation and put you to death, and you will be hated by all nations for my name's sake. Is this happening right now? We are so far in to the revelation, and the church hardly notices it. Because they're refusing to teach. You need to beg your pastor, preach it. He'll say, oh, I'm not sure I quite understand it all. We just say, read it then. Because the Bible promised the blessing from that chapter. If you hear it and study it and preach it, it's time to do it. Absolutely. You know, here's where we are, people. And, and I shared this with you, I think, on my last broadcast or one of the broadcasts last week. Matthew uh, 24, verse 33 uh, I, I'm just quickly throwing this out to, to remind you of what we saw. Matthew 24 is very clear. So after Jesus, this is the, Jesus talking, it talks about all the things that are coming on the earth, all the earthquakes, all the famine, all the things, fire from the sky, and all the things that are going to happen. And then it says in verse 33, I, I read this a few days ago for you. So also when you see these signs, all taken together, coming to pass, you may know of a surety that he is near at the very door. When you see all the things from Matthew 24, that is the coming of the Lord. The what Jesus said will be the signs of his coming back. And then in the book of Revelation, it, it, it basically it says the same thing. And, and I, it's, it's like Matthew 24 is an index to the book of Revelation. And we're living in both areas. We're living in Matthew 24, and we're living in the book of Revelation. And people, you just need to be aware. God says, I don't want that day to come upon you unaware. He wants you to know things are going to happen that was, they're going to shock you. You know, an asteroid came so close to the earth just a few hours ago. Did you know that? Yes, I did. And they said they didn't see it. Yes. <clears throat> and, it, and it would have literally, if it had hit uh, like New York, New York would have been gone. That's how, that's how powerful it was. But it was the, one of the closest passes of any asteroid in history. And you know, the, they didn't have any idea. They had no idea that, right. you know, they can, you know, uh, with technology, they know when these asteroids are all over the place. This one caught them off guard. No warning. So when you see these signs, all taken together, coming to pass, you may know of a surety that he is near at the very door. I truly, I tell you, this generation is the whole multitude of people living at the same time in a definite given period who will not pass away till all these things taken together take place. All of them will take place in one generation. And we are that generation. The generation that has seen knowledge increase.